September the 4th of 2023, a taxi driver is driving late at night around 3 a.m. somewhere in the Philippines, when suddenly someone waves him down for him to give them a ride. That's when he captures this. The door opens and then slams shut on its own as if someone entered the car. He then proceeds to ask her where she's going, but no response is heard. Although he claims she told him she wanted to go to Scouts Barrio, a neighborhood in Baguio, Philippines, and that's when he began driving. But after checking in the mirror and seeing nothing, he notices there's nobody in the back seat and begins to panic. What makes this even stranger is that we can see on the front dash cam where he stops for the lady, and there's clearly nobody there. So says that her clothes were really long and looked like that of a Jesus devotee, which adds to the eeriness of this video. Just who or what opened the car door and will it be following him home? You this next video, a child is getting ready to go to school when something very strange happens. It was on a Monday at around 7 a.m. that this happened. He was packing his lunch for school at a time when no one else was awake. It was just him alone downstairs in the kitchen. This is where the mother claims to have heard her son screaming out of his lungs in the most gut-wrenching manner. The video captures this, but there's also something else that's caught that no one in the family could explain. This is their footage. A voice with perfect clarity is heard on camera. The mother's son claims that it came from the kitchen, yet no one had been downstairs during this time. The whole space was empty apart from her son being there, but as it seems, he wasn't alone. Now this whole incident gets even creepier when listening to the story provided by the mother. According to her, this is what happened after her son came bolting into the bedroom upstairs. He said that he heard a voice coming from the cabinets um, that said to him, how did you find me? Um, when he dropped his noodles, he ran upstairs, came busting in my room, jumping all over my bed, hiding in the corner, screaming and hollering, saying he didn't want to die. Somebody was in the house, somebody was in the house, telling me to get mine because somebody was in the house, somebody was in the house. And I'm like, and he finally did get a little bit quiet. We started hearing footsteps. I mean, big, heavy feet coming up the steps. So like now at this point, I'm terrified. I, I throw my robe on, I push him into the room with his brothers. As she states, the sound of footsteps going up the staircase was heard just moments after her son came running into the room. Everyone else had been inside the room, so she had no clue as to who was on the staircase. But after watching this video, she now knows. 
Either someone was actually there, or, as many believe, something beyond comprehension had paid them a visit. Whatever the case might be, her son's guttural scream will stand out as the most horrifying part about this incident, according to the mother. Now, just like the previous video, this one involves a family celebrating someone's birthday. Happy birthday, dear Ben! Like any birthday celebration, a candlelit cake is placed before the honored guest. But there's something about this video that sets it apart from any other festive moment caught on camera. While friends and family sing happy birthday, this happens. Happy birthday, dear Ben! Happy birthday! Happy birthday to you. Cha, cha, cha. Happy birthday, dear Ben. Happy birthday to you. Just like viewers, Ben, the birthday boy, is caught off guard upon seeing smoke rise from his cake. It wasn't until looking down that he realized his candles had been blown out. He didn't blow them, and neither did anyone else, according to the party. Yet if no one blew out the cake, then what did? This video becomes even stranger when looking at the footage taken from a different perspective. From this angle, we have a closer look at the candles, but it's the way in which they're supposedly blown that makes this incident baffling. They appear to go out as though someone or something had been right in front of the cake, yet the only person who's closest to it is Ben, who clearly doesn't do anything. It isn't certain as to what exactly happened that day, but if viewers had a guess, they would assume something unexplainable had taken place. This creepy video comes from Chris Buell, I'll tag it below, and they posted video of their son Connor, who begins to stand on the railing of his crib with seemingly perfect balance, and it's almost as if he's being held up by something we can't see. But what happens next is pretty unsettling. Now not much is known about this video, or that it's even paranormal at all, but in the description of the video it did say that he was unharmed. But definitely let me know in the comments, what do you think about this? A group of friends decided to explore an abandoned parking lot full of buses that are no longer used. They stated that the buses are all inoperable and no longer functioning so they were left behind. But another reason they have come to explore this area is because it's typically known for being an extremely haunted place. In Soyapango, El Salvador, many people claim to have heard buses here at night as well as seen shadow figures and passengers on the empty vehicles. The crew's fun adventure quickly takes a creepy turn while talking to one of the local residents who lives next to the parking lot. I'm 
si no hay nadie adentro. Miremos si no hay nadie adentro. They were just getting ready to leave, thinking the haunting rumors were just rumors. When suddenly, they see the rear light of the bus turned on. They look at the inside and see nothing that could explain this occurrence. Although this is what they wanted to see, they are now creeped out, now that it's happened. So they decide to check out the rest of the area, when suddenly they turn around and notice this. Ah, no, mami, güey. A dark shadow figure can be seen in the distance just standing there next to the bus that had the rear light on. Upon realizing this, the group felt chills run down their spine, so they decided to not stick around and just leave. They are now convinced that the rumors are true and are certain they saw a ghost that night. They were celebrating her birthday when this happens. A woman named Jocelyn was with her family celebrating her birthday when suddenly as she's getting ready to blow the candles, this happens. Two. Happy birthday. Oh my god, she's making the way. Happy birthday. There's a lot of millions in the sky. What the heck? Who's that? Who blew it out? I don't know her because he said it was her. Was it Carmen? That was weird. It was a win. Mi abuelita. What win? There's no win. There's a door with an open. What the heck? Who's that? Can we have one? Have to take it. Just 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 take the candle suddenly went out on their own as if someone blew them. Jocelyn uploaded this haunting, unexplicable phenomenon onto her social media page with many questions left unanswered. Could it be a lingering spirit who also celebrated their birthday in that home? Let me know your thoughts. Can we talk about this creepy video out of Texas by TikTok user Lady V? I'll tag her below. And while working night shift at a hospital, she's able to capture a ghostly voice of one of the resident spirits where she works. And many commenters were quick to point out that they too work at hospitals and have seen and heard things that they can't explain. And while the ghostly voice that she captured is faint, many believe it's calling out for its mother. I've enhanced the audio as best I can, but definitely let me know. What do you think? Did you hear her? Yes. You hear her? Hmm. She probably thinks I'm her mom. That was you. No, I swear to God. Was that something? Bitch, go home. <laughs> Do not play this game. The red door yellow door game is a dangerous game played by two people, one who guides and one who explores doors within their own mind. But this spooky game carries several warnings. 
Avoid interacting with people you see in the room. Their intentions are unknown and might trick you. Clock-filled rooms are to be avoided too as they can trap players. You must always choose the path upward and steer towards the brighter colored doors. If you find yourself stuck in a room, try to wake up quickly. Staying too long might leave you trapped in the game forever. The most alarming figure is a man in a suit. When you see him, end the game immediately or he will unalive you. So if you are brave enough and want to play the game, comment part 2, but I still recommend that. The photos you're about to see are claimed to be real and not edited. This photo was taken in a Zoom meeting. As you can see, there's a creepy woman in white standing behind her. The sender said that her churchmate was alone in her house and she didn't saw anyone that time. They are all creeped out when they saw that ghost on their monitor. This photo was taken in a university in Negros, Philippines. When a group of students took a selfie while walking outside the campus, they saw in the picture that there was someone or something was behind them. When they looked back, no one's there. This last photo was a group of students drinking inside their room. When they took a selfie, they revealed that they had an uninvited guest behind them. <laughs> 